Hey, what's up, everybody? This is DJ Keo for the Best in Music. So, in uh, continuing my Nam coverage, <laughs> I sound like I'm talking about Vietnam. I I know that. I just I know it. I know what it sounds like. I have to listen to this stuff after record it. I know what it sounds like, but just it is what it is. Um. Yeah. So, t- 2016 coverage. Um. I think the most interesting thing I've seen so far out of everybody who's released a uh, gear is this new dashboard from Newmark. And so if you could say 2016 is the year of smaller, cheaper copycats, um, this is, this is like a, a nice bright spot out of all of these usual same old things. I like seeing companies come up with a solution to something that seems obvious from the start. So enough rambling about it. Basically what it is, is um, it's the dashboard, the screens from Newmark's NS73. Um, They basically just yanked the screens out of it and made it a standalone product for Serato, which as a tractor user, I just look at stuff like this. I'm just like, Native Instruments, get your shit together, man. God damn it. Anyways, so uh, basically, it's the screens, and uh, it shows you everything that you would see from, like, a, a CDJ or something like that. So you get your waveforms. You get to see uh, BPMs, uh, file, file, Thing majig. Basically, you get to look through your files. Um, you see, you browse your folders, look through your songs, whatever. And um, in a center display, you have your two waveforms on top of each other. Classic Serato. And uh, yeah, it looks cool. One of the good things I like about this is that there's a USB hub on the back of this. So you can basically plug this into your computer and you have two USB hubs two USB ports in the back of the screen. And uh, that's handy. That's really handy. I like stuff like that. That's actually really cool. And um, it, they said it works for pretty much all major DJ gear. And it's kind of integrated into Serato. So basically everything that you need to see from the screens, whatever, it just shows up and it works flawlessly with stuff that's not even from Newmark. So that's really cool. I like that a lot. Um, it has like a adjustable screen so you can tilt them and lift it higher or whatever. But something like that, I wouldn't mind seeing this in DJ booths. Like this is really, really cool. And, you know, you could save a couple bucks and buy a cheaper CDJ and basically get all of the same performance. Not really, but... You, <laughs> you you get some of the performance, I should say, <laughs> that you would out of uh, a more expensive controller with a screen or CDJ or whatever. Um, price. Uh, price looks like it's about 400 bucks and quarter two, so spring, <laughs> spring-ish, 2016. It's called a new mark dashboard, and I like this. I'm giving this to DJ Keel thumb of approval. Uh, I saw a little bit of it in action, and it looks like it does what it needs to do. So, yay. Um, I'm actually kind of excited about this. I would I would definitely buy one. And uh, I think one of the things I noticed about this year for a DJ gear is that everybody's trying to push you into closing your laptop or just shoving it away. And I'm I'm okay with that. Uh, you know, you have the option to. You don't have to close your laptop. You can just you can use it or not use it. But like I I've noticed that a lot of the like, uh, Gemini just released a controller that's like the Denon controller that I talked about last week. I think. Um. Yeah, you know, like I think that's a good thing for the industry to kind of get your head out of the laptop and back facing people again so you know i'm on board stuff like this this is kind of cool i like it um i actually probably will buy one 400 bucks yeah sure why not um 
I don't know where I would put it, but I'm just looking at my my setup right now, and <laughs> I don't know where I would put it. I'd probably have to move the laptop because basically my laptop is where everybody has it, like directly behind my my mixer or my turntables. But I guess I have to put it on the side. Um, it looks interesting. I I like I like what they're doing with this, and uh, I I hope more companies are using their head to solve problems instead of just copying what the other guy is doing. So, you know, kudos to that. Yeah, no, I don't, I don't have anything else to say. <laughs> uh, if you like the video, please like and subscribe. And uh, peace out. Peace. <laughs>